thing about Ryan is like his uh for the living you know the Ryan is his real name. His yeah. his uh his PS man, he's very good at stock tanking. He's excellent at stock tanking. Okay. And I think that's what's gonna help him more because with the Rob, you have to kinda commit to more going in. And with Pac-Man you can play a little more campy with you know the fruits and you know hydrant and whatever you want to do with. Okay. So Honestly he's probably second best Pac Man in Michigan. Behind Nebula? No, Nebula is the best Pac-Man, and Sup's probably second best. Like, you don't see Sup play in singles, like, almost ever. But if you yeah. play a friendly with him, he's... He's solid. He knows he knows what he's doing, for sure. And I same with Ramsey. He doesn't enter stuff, but he's good when you play I, him. I really want to see him pull, up, pull off the famous Wisconsin when he won the crew battle for us. That was amazing. Oh, I forgot about that. That was excellent. Sup wins the crew battle. The crew had like everyone on it. I know. It was the most stacked. He was down by two stocks. Yeah, Sup is just there like because they needed an eighth person and he ended up flushing <laughs> it out. <laughs> Taking two stocks when he was at like 60%. Oh, looks like a button check. Yeah, it looks like his controller didn't reset. Oh, is she a button? He's going to go with Pac Man. Though. So now we know. Nero, stop being such a buster. Stop being a buster. Probably have to play soon. It's probably going to be my last set for a while. Or for the rest of the night. Mm -hmm. Or forever. Potentially no. my last set that no. I ever commentate. You don't know. You can't say for sure. <laughs> I can't say. I can't guarantee that I'll commentate another set. I'm not going to make promises I can't keep. <laughs> All right, and it looks like we are going to start out on uh, Smashville. I and uh, I, honestly, I think this favors uh, Ness. Yeah. Slam. Yeah, Ness. Back throw kills early. It's got is, the smallest this side This is good for Falco, time. too. Yeah, honestly, this is where he beat me by only hitting me six times last night. <laughs> it's okay. You, you, got, you got that run back. <laughs> Anyways, already hopping to things. Nero getting that. Oh, my God. Tabor's already going for some jank stuff. He was nowhere near him, and he's going for a down smash. Falco's double jump throws me off so much. It's so high. Like, his first yep. jump is high, but his second jump is so high. Yep. Like, he can double jump from where Pac-Man is and make it all the way up above the stage and back air yep. me. It doesn't help that he's got, like, the most brutal back air in the whole game. He does. It's very quick. I think it's, I believe it's frame 12, I want to say. Uh, it's faster than frame 12. Yeah. It's like frame 4. It's like Luigi's. For, you think it's that, that? Wow. It's like 4 or 5. I mean, Wolf's and Brawl was like frame three or four, I think, mm -hmm. and if Falco's is like as fast or a little bit slower than that. Mm -hmm. I might also just be making up nonsense, but I don't <laughs> think it's frame 12. Frame 12 is like much slower than... That's true. That's than like than that's like Cloud's back here. Yeah, yeah. That nice forwarder. Move. Ned's is one of the downfalls of... Oh, oh my god, nice patience by Sup. Yeah. So Sup ended up being the first one to lose the stock. Goes okay. against what you said, but you, you know he'll probably. He's got that forward air, and then he yeah. Because that's that's sort of Pac-Man's downfall is when he's recovering like that. You you any any like lingering hitbox move can knock him out of it. Yeah. That was good up B by by stuff. I'm just watching stuff. I'm yeah. not a, these are people I've played and watched play a million times. So I'm like, I gotta see what stuff's doing. Oh, I'm trying to spike with a hydrant. <laughs> what he upbeat no. in the middle of the up smash hits, but then. Didn't make it to the ledge. Wanted to land on the ledge. Yeah. Nice forward smash by, uh, by Nero. They still got the same amount of stocks on both They teams. do. No, that's so good DI. Good DI. Yep. The Pikachu's so light, but Nero knows how to DI. Nero's a legend. He is. He's, he's improved. Ooh. Unfortunate up smash. Nero but, uh, and Daybreak are two of the fastest improving players I've ever They have. Imagined. And part of the reason is because Nero just goes to so many tournaments, and he adapts very quickly. He has ironically good reads. Yeah. Sub's doing a good job uh, with these up Bs. He just... He needs to just... Yeah. He just needs to get back on the stage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he hasn't been killed, like, off a of blast zone. They, they he just, just keeps not making it back. And part of the problem is they're not, they're not keeping stage control enough, and that's one of the things that Pac-Man, like, needs to do. Sub jumped up and tried to throw the key, but he accidentally mm -hmm. reversed it. Oh no! Gets reflected. Wow, that was ridiculous! Oh, wow. 
And uh, I, I don't know if they're going to be able to bring this back. No. It's asking a lot. Forward air, back air. No. Oh, no, he's oh alive. Oh, my God. Going for some jank stuff. Yeah. See if Daybreak, oh, nice back air. accidentally goes down and tries to down air him. Yeah. Yeah. Oops. It was an accident. <laughs> I didn't Daybreak mean to looks right at me. <laughs> I didn't mean to fast fall. I didn't mean to go all the way down where I couldn't come back and down air him. Slam, po <laughs> Slam pulls a Rayquaza and just walks away from the set, gets some water, makes everybody wait. Uh, I think we're gonna oh, see there's where he reflected. That was so dirty. I think we're going to see a counter pick to either Battlefield or uh, Final Destination. Because I know... Final uh, Destination is a good stage for these guys. Oh, well, Lilat. So would, wow. Oh, Lilat's Pikachu's best stage by far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what it does for Pac-Man, Pac but yeah. Pikachu destroys on Lilat. I'm surprised this wasn't banned because Falco's recovery can be gimped very easily here. Yeah, I, I can't... Maybe they banned Dreamland for Possibly. the same reason, but Lilat is a very good stage for Pikachu. And it's a very bad stage for anybody who enjoys having fun. Yeah, this stage, honestly, I feel like it's worse for Ness and Falco, so we're going to see if they can take advantage of that. Yeah. I wouldn't take that last match as an indication of how the whole set would go. Oh, definitely. This is a good team. Um, fell victus, uh, victim to some pretty uh, surprising kills. Mm -hmm. And unfortunate SDs. And some SDs, yeah. yeah. So they could, they could do much better this game. This time they nice. got to focus more on the stage control. They do, and and, uh, and they've been they're I doing mean, a good job of that so far. Yeah, it's early in the set, but I mean, uh, Pikachu, Pac-Man are just standing safe in the middle of the stage the whole time, and both the other guys have been con exactly. consistently trying to get back. And you can see it in their playstyles too. They're feeling the oh, Force Smash's dash attack. Pac-Man's got one of the best dash attacks. He does. He didn't even make it over there. Up smash. Yep. Yeah. Another up smash. Except he, that's what Nier likes doing. He likes just like up smashing because he, he, his thing is like, who who expects four up smashes in a row? Yeah, yeah. yeah I, we like to throw out a lot of up smashes. You know? <laughs> we learned it from Ally. He come here, come over. <laughs> invincible us, up smash. Taught us how good it was to just up smash over just and over. Just flick the C stick up. A nice oh, save there by Nero. Saved him. He nice. was in the PK Thunder about to get bad. He ended up dying anyway, exactly. but. Nero ran over and and completely turned the. He 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 covered yeah, yeah. his teammates. It was really good. Was, it was great. Situational awareness is so important in this game. Yeah, especially in doubles. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's crucial for them to get like a some form of gimp on either one of Falco or yeah. Ness. Yeah, I didn't notice up lost his second stock. He did. Yeah. Oh man. Daybreak went out there and tried to down air him, but the trampoline was there. Now this is completely doable. Oh I've, yeah. I've seen them come back from this many times. Yeah. Daybreak doesn't care what it does to Ness. Mm -hmm. He's going to combo that Pikachu, and if Ness happens to get hit as well, then so be it. <laughs> and that's uh, that's the that's the thing with like mid-level gameplay. You're gonna see some flukes. And uh, I mean, honestly, I think he did the right thing. He was just it's better to hit both than neither, mm -hmm. especially when you have the lead. Ness can grab from so far. It is without his uh, Pika Thunder. That's gonna be no. Oh, I was looking at the, I was looking yet. at Falco's percent. If he gets hit again, then the next one might. Do Maybe. It. Oh, he footstooled him. Was it a fair footstool? Or was it just? I a think it was. Still. I think it was for a footstool. Oh, stop! Nice double kill. The legend. <laughs> can he bring this back, yo? If he can bring. Oh my God. Do you have sub takes four stocks? Is it a okay, I thought it was it's so oh. unlikely, but I just it, it, it. I want it so badly. Oh, that grab! He should just be in a forward smash. Obnoxious. He just calmly walks away. Are we going to see a run off down here? Yeah, he probably only goes for it when he's up by four stocks. <laughs> 
stuff still alive. Oh man, they're doing a good job of make it take covering every option oh, for get up. up. Nice. There they got it. That side B though. That was really good. Yes, it was. Um, I'm pretty sure.